Hello everyone, the video explains about the project creation in Kale file. First we have to open the software. For new project creation, go to your project, select new project, give file name. Then extract STM electronics and select a series regarding ARM Cortex M0 64 pin package. Click OK. Extract target, create a new group. Then add existing file with the new group one. The existing file is nothing but it is a startup files. After adding this one, move on to source group. Add existing file with the source group. Then extract source group. Click target, option for target. Give clock frequency rate as 8 MHz. Create hex file. Then we have to include a path. For include the path, have to browse the files. Next two words, have to add a path file from our templates. Move on to our template file. You can see header file path there. Copy down. Paste it here. Click OK. Double click the main function. Below the main function. Try to write a program for LED blink. Initially, have to mention a clock frequency rate with the help of AHBENR register. This is a default rate. Next to that, we have to mention a different types of register here. First one is Moder. It will decide the pin which we have selected as output or input. Here we took PC9 pin as a output mode. It follows O type register. It will decide the output mode whether it is in push pull or open drain. We fix it as push pull mode. Then PUPDR register it is in pull up mode Within while loop, have to set and reset the pin. Pitch set will be done. Delay function have to be defined. 
to blink the LED in a certain period of time. This indicates the reset the pin. We didn't mention any delay definition in this program. To mention that delay function, move on to above the main function. Have to write a program over there. Okay, this is our program. Then compile your program. Click build target. The compilation will be successfully done only after it will be shown as zero errors, zero warnings. Now we got zero errors and zero warnings. This is the program for LED blinking. Thanks for watching this video.